Cancel. Cancel. <clears throat> What's up, everybody? Um, Recording. So, today was... I had a few ups and downs. Um, and I will get to that in just a minute. Um, it, it, it was... It was a hard day, but I was able to push through it. Um, I mean, I I still had a good day, but there were there were some ups and downs to it. But and I like I said, I will get to that in just a minute. Um, but right now, actually, I'm gonna hold on just a minute. I'm gonna shut off the keyboard because if I hold on, I'm gonna end up pushing some buttons. I'm going to move over. I'm not wearing all the bling today because <laughs> I was too lazy to put it on. Whoa! But I will tell you why. Why the day was a little hard, but it actually leads to some big news. Some big news that I really want to um, let you guys know about. Create lip two camera wants to fill. David Cole joined. Pro Lillian McGrath joined. Pro Arrow Arts joined. Pro Rebecca Sulang joined. Pro Danny Alfaro joined. Pro invite. Hey, what's up? Profile picture. Image. So um. Some, some big news. And would you like me to call you Rebecca or Becky? Wh which which would you prefer? I, I just hope you don't get angry at me for this. Um, so I was having a hard time today because um, there were a lot of boys that were wanting to go out with me. I, I had two boys go out with me or wanting to go out with me notifications one new it, it, it was hard it, it was really really hard to pick one <clears throat> and I, I i asked my mom i said who, who should i go out with she said it's up to me and i'm like i, I know that i i understand and I, and I told her you know what's been going on and she told me so I finally got, I started a group call on Messenger with two of my Facebook friends, one of them happening to be, you know, my ex, and um, I, I told him, you know, I feel like our relationship just wasn't working, you know, because I felt like, you know, we just, I felt like we didn't have much in common. I mean, not trying to be mean. I wasn't trying to be mean about it. I, I just felt like, you know, our stuff was just, our relationship was just kind of drifting apart because I felt like I didn't have, you know, much in common. And I guess he was just jealous that, you know, I'm, I'm not trying to talk shit about anybody. I'm not trying to put anybody down. But I guess he was just jealous that I was talking to josh more than i was talking to him and i was like i mean i i understand that and messages josh price what's up baby girl hey listen to this i just told my aunt about what you went through with alan and hell i thought you deserved a whole lot better and how i thought he was immature in my um don't siri please don't nothing happened that was nothing that was nothing That was just nothing. I was just hearing things, that's all. That, that wasn't... Fuck you, Siri. Piece of shit. Sorry. Um, but no, um, I'll, I'll finish that. Um... Invite... Aisha Nash, hey, waving hand. Hey. Prof. Rebecca, suit like no one on one time. Oh, okay. Prof. Leah Care joined. Prof. Rebecca, suit like Rebecca. 
Oh, okay. So you want me to call you Rebecca? Like I said, I just felt like it wasn't working. I mean, I don't mean to put anyone down. I really don't. It's just, I feel like when you meet a guy, you have to have a lot in common. You have to know him for at least, at least a, a while, like years. You have to know them for like years until, you know, you can go out with them. And I, I knew Josh for a while. Him and I just made a really good couple. And, um... I'm sorry. I'm I'm just happy and um well, I'm going to read this t I'm going to turn the phone down because I don't want anyone getting into this. I do. I'm glad that we're together. I'm sorry, guys. I'm trying not to. I'm. I'm just so happy. I. I really. Yes, I would. Exclamation mark. I'm. I'm not sad. I just. But no, um, I feel like when you meet a guy, I, I told, I, I'm, I'm a little confused. Um, so I told, I, um, I feel like when you meet a guy, you have to have a lot in common. You have to, um, age doesn't matter to me. Age really doesn't matter to me, but when you go out with someone, I mean, you have to have a lot in common. You have to know them for, like, a while, a long time. And that's how I felt about Josh. I mean, I, I do love, I, I like Alan. I really do. He's nice, and um, he, he understands most of my problems, I feel like. Screened him. But I feel like me and Josh just fit together. I don't mean to hurt anybody's feelings or anything. Leah, Rebecca, Aish, Rebecca, Sue Lang, it's okay. Long distance relationships do not work. I know. I, I was afraid you'd end up blocking me about that. I was like, oh my gosh. But it's okay. Profile pitch. Profile. Brendan Siphon joined. Pro. Hiroyuki Takuchi joined. Pro. Rebecca Sulang. It's okay, girl. I get it. Ellipsis. And I am not mad. You can keep the necklace. It's cool. I'm going to. I really think it looks good on me. I'm keeping the necklace. I love it so much. Pro. Nathan Clark joined. Pro. Tyler Sledge joined. Hey, guys. Pro. Rebecca, Sue Lang, I hope you can still be friends. Oh, yeah, we definitely will. I, I told him that. It's okay to still be friends, and I know relationships are hard when you break up, and, um, my mom has been through a lot, too. My mom has been through the same relationships. I'm, I'm trying not to cry. I'm, I'm really trying not to cry. I'm having mixed feelings. I, I feel sad for breaking up but I feel I, I feel happy that me and Josh are together and I feel like him and I just fit together a lot I'm trying so hard not to cry it, it's really emotional <laughs> Pro planet swan joined Pro Rebecca Sue Lang I try very hard to stay out of my boys relationships yeah, I, I I can understand that. I really can understand that. Invite profile picture image. 
but I'm I'm okay. I I really am. But I've I've known him ever since fifth grade. I've known. Seven fifty four messages. Now, Josh Price, you will really like my uncle Dennis. He is a comedian, and when I say comedian, I do mean an absolute comedian. He is funny, but I will make sure you get to meet my family. Thank you. Messages. Message. Text. Thank you, exclamation mark. Yeah, I've I've been through relationships. Oh yeah, really? Anyway, I've been through relationships ever since fifth grade. I first went out with a guy that <laughs> um he said that I had attitude and I I agreed. I I did have attitude back in the day. Actually, I had a lot of attitude when I started going to the Indiana School for the Blind for my public school because I, I felt lonelier because I had my friends there. But then when I went to the Indiana School for the Blind, I felt really comfortable there after a few years. I felt I felt like that was my school Screamed to it. be at. It was my home. It was my it, it was my favorite school. I loved that. If I had to choose that for my public school, I'd choose Indiana School for the Blind and Visually Impaired. But back to what I was saying, um, I dated somebody in fifth grade. I dated a guy named Christian, and, um, well, he, he said I had some attitude, and I, I'll, I'll I agree. <laughs> I did. But then in seventh grade, you know... I think it was 7th grade. 7th or 8th, I dated a guy named Logan. And it never really worked out. It just really never worked out. And then I, I kept making uh, making up and breaking up with a guy named Dustin. And it really never worked out. But I feel like these guys were leading me to the the best boyfriend, to the to the better guy. I feel like they were leading me to the better guy that would that would help me you know that would understand and I'm, I'm not saying you know i'm not saying that these guys are worth nothing because that's not true they they they're worth everything to me i i love them as as much as i love everybody in my family i really do and you know it's it's hard it's really hard choosing which guy you want, and I understand for the people out there, but seriously, follow what your heart tells you to do. Follow what your heart seriously tells you to do, and I don't mean this in a negative way. I'm actually, I feel like this is some really extreme news. Well, let me get out of this. Rebecca, pro planet pro Rebecca, Pro Pat Burdner joined. Pro Holly Jane joined. Pro Erwin mm -hmm. Thomas joined. Pro TJ Trusty joined. Pro Invite. Button. Now, Josh Price, you're welcome. But let me tell you something. What? I am a really firm believer in the old fashioned tradition that when two people go out with each other, they should meet their families. I've already. I agree. Mind, but I want you to meet my family. That's just my beliefs and my morals. I love it. Agreed. Insert and agree. Message. Send. Button. Send. Record audio. Button. I've I've never been this happy. I mean, along with the Lifehouse concert, I've I've never been this happy in my life. I really was about to be single for a while, but then I was just like fuck it. I'm doing it. I don't care. But I will keep the stuff that all my ex-boyfriends have given me. YouTube. Because Bailey Isong replied. Audrey Contreras. Annie. Attachment. 
but I'm going to keep all the stuff that my ex-boyfriends have given me because it's, received from it's a lot of memories. C. I am totally different from Alan. Yes. And believe me, actually, Josh went out with uh, someone just last year, and it worked for six months. But then, you know, they had separate classes, and they weren't able they weren't able to see each other a lot. So it's it's hard. It really is. Heather King, hey. I really hope I didn't do anything wrong earlier. No, you didn't. You really didn't do anything wrong. It's just, you know, when when um Screened you go out with something, they just kind of want to have a, a private chat. It's it's okay. I understand. You you did nothing wrong. I'm sorry. I I know. I'm I'm obsessing over this. I'm sorry. Melissa E. Now joined. Alicia Holderfield Strauss joined. Heather King joined. TJ Trusty joined. Melissa E. Now Alicia Holderfield Strauss joined. Hey, Miss Strauss. I, I really miss you and all the stuff that we did today. Or, bleh, I can't talk. <laughs> but I miss the, the times that we had in school. You do realize that I'm not crying because I'm I'm sad. I'm actually crying because I'm I'm really happy. I'm I'm trying not to though. I really am. <clears throat> I mean I'm I'm crying that I'm I'm also sad that you know we broke up, but I'm I'm just happy that I found the right one. Proof Melissa Proof Heather Proof Jesse D. Westcott joined. Hey. Heather King, no, you're fine. You guys are great together. But have you ever felt like that? Like, you you have mixed emotions and not negative. I don't mean this with negativity. Have you ever, like, broke up with someone and then the same day you go out with the guy that you you really wanted to and... You cry because, well, you're sad that you broke up with the other person, but you're happy because you f you finally found the person that you wanted. I'm pretty sure it's common. Proof, Heather King, yes, I have. It, it's common. It's seriously common. It really... <laughs> ah. Proof, invite, button, profile picture. I'm getting a lot of views. I told you it's extremely big news. It really is. I mean, I knew Christian and I went out together in fifth grade, but... And we knew each other the first day. But it's just... Josh and I have a lot in common. And it's about to go down August 29th. Seriously. Hold on just a minute. Hold on just a minute. Camera's probably pointing at my ceiling. I would read that, but at the same time, you know, it's going to catch me off guard. I love that song.
like that. So Josh yeah. Price, aren't you glad I believe that way? You're gonna make me cry. <laughs> totally glad! Exclamation mark. Send. Send. Record audio. Button. I like that. I love that song. I really want to know what it is. Heather, proof. Heather King was your private talk good. It was. It really, it was deep and, and really awesome. I'm just glad that we had it. And, and it's funny because he wanted to go out, Josh wanted to go out with me when I was already going out with someone else. <laughs> it, it's kind of funny that way. Pet profile, yeah. Heather King, great beatboxer. <laughs> Thank you. I really want to know what that song is. Siri might know. Proof. Christine gets enjoined. Hey, that's my mom. That's my mom. Proof. Invite. Button. I always say this with my mom. Kiss, kiss. Hi, mom. Kiss, kiss. We always say that together. Christina gets enjoined. My stomach is my stomach's growling, and it wants—I mean, it wants me to eat something, but some sad stuff just happened. My stomach started hurting again. Yay! <laughs> no, it's not actually. I think it's because my mom got some. My mom got two things of ice cream my mom got me this like this cherry ice cream it's like vanilla ice cream with chocolate chunks and cherries and she bought this brownie chunk ice cream this ice cream this chocolate ice cream with brownie chunks in it and i think the brownie has gluten in it Messages, Josh Price. You're already making me cry, dude. You seriously already are? You already are, exclamation mark. And I'm live, exclamation mark. But I think they know that I'm crying because I'm happy, exclamation mark. Heather King, hey, Sienna's mom. <laughs> Pro invite. But profile picture. Image. I know I keep repeating myself, but like I said, I'm not crying because I'm sad. I'm really crying because, you know, I'm happy. I'm, I finally got my, the one I wanted. The one I've wanted for... At least nine years now. I mean, he he never really wanted to go out with me in school because, you know, he wanted to get things sorted out, and I, I respect that. I, I kind of wanted to get things sorted out in school, too, and it, it's really, it's really hard. When you're in school and all this drama happens and this and that and all these rumors and, you know, and more of this and that, it, it's hard. It really is, and... I, I respect that, you know, if you don't want to go out with someone while you're in school because you're having 
so much drama going on. I really, I really love this song. I really want to know what it is. Um, but um, back to what I was saying, I, I understand when you when you're in school and all this happens and all that happens and you have a crush on this person, but you just want to get it all sorted out. I, I totally respect that. It's it's com I'm pretty sure it's common for a lot of people. I know my live video shouldn't be picking up these messages, but... Messages. Josh... The female Siri already read it. Heather, prof, Heather King are so cute. I... I know. <laughs> prof, Heather King, that's why I'm glad I met Brendan after school. I know. I mean, it's... Hold on. And I respect that while we were in school together, you didn't want to go out together because you wanted to get things sorted out, period. And I know that when you're in school, comma, there's a lot of drama, comma, rumors, comma, and a lot of this and that, period. I hope nobody's, I hope nobody's uncomfortable with me using dictation and sending these messages <coughs> profile Zoe Bolton joined hi Zoe Prof invite but profile picture image that was probably YouTube But that's really what I wanted to tell you guys. And and he said that we're, well, we're both blind, but he says that he wants to go out somewhere like together for a whole day. Just him and just him and I. And I'm like, I, I really think that's a good idea. And mom may be there, you know, just um, because, you know, we need someone there to help us because we're both totally blind. And, you know, that's okay. I'm, I'm really, I'm okay with that because my mom can be trusted. Zoe Bolton joined. Pro Heather King, I don't mind. Okay, that's good. Pro invite. Profile picture. Image. So what do you guys think of that news? Like I said, I, I will keep all the stuff that my ex-boyfriends have given me. Every single one of my ex-boyfriends. Because it's the memories. It's, I mean, I don't mind being friends with all of my exes, but it's, it's the memories. And the friendship that counts. It's all the memories and all the friendship that counts. But, yeah, that's, that's really my big news, and I'm, I'm really, I'm extremely happy. I feel like nothing can bring me down right now. Nothing. Not one single thing. I feel like nothing can just bring me down from all this. And I'm sorry if I was crying and you know almost crying i'm i'm sorry i know you don't want to see me cry but like i said uh 
zillion times. I wasn't doing it because I was sad. I, I was mostly happy. Happy that I finally got the man I wanted. And I think I'm going to dedicate Lifehouse. I'm going to dedicate you and me to him. I'm, I'm going to do that right now. Oh, you idiot. Exactly. I'm pretty sure that that really that can happen. I think you and I really quick. A lot of, I'm, I'm pretty sure it happens with some people. Cracks in our friendship bring them closer. I don't mean this as a pun, comma. It's the truth, period. But it's you and me and all the other people. And I, I don't know why, but I can't take my eyes off of you, period. Send. Record audio. Button. Yuki prof Yuki Poyano joined. Profile. Invite. Button. I'm not copying off of Jason Wade. I'm being serious. I seriously am being serious. And him and I, him and I, like, we collaborated together. We've made songs together. And we've talked about our problems together. Screen. And we've, we've solved a lot of our problems together. And he's, give, he's gave me so much advice. But, um, yeah, it, I feel like this is going to work out. And I think, I believe him with the cracks in our friendship, all the arguments in our friendship brought us closer. And I'm pretty sure it's happened with a lot of other people, not just me. When it brings you closer, you feel like, you know, that person is just, the right man for you or you feel like he's he's like a brother to you or a father to you or something you know or maybe it's even a girl two girls that get into arguments and then when it brings them closer it's like they're sisters and they want to hang out more and um it just makes them love each other more and it makes them, you know, want to talk about their problems and ask each other, you know, how should I solve this? Any advice? Can I have some help? It makes them want to talk about them more. Comment. And Heather King, you guys might be together the rest of your lives. I agree. I really do agree. I seriously hope so. And who cares that if we're blind and we both live together on our own, we're, we will have someone there to help us. But, you know, we'll always help each other. That's, that's the best part. We'll always help each other with, you know, our problems and we'll help each other around the house. I feel like everything's going to be okay. Patricia Saunders joined. Pro Angela Daniel joined. Pro Yuki Koyano joined. Pro Angela Pro Patricia Pro Heather Key Pro Invite Profile Picture. If you guys want to share this video and tell your friends about it, 
if you want to tell my tell every one of your friends about it and tell them the whole story I'm quite okay with that feel free to share this video with everyone and and tell them the big news that your Facebook friend Sienna Craig has told and I actually dedicated you and me by Lifehouse to Josh I really just did just a minute ago I'd, I'd really I want to find the video and share it with him well except he can't see video but I'd, I'd probably find the audio and share it with him Heather King, it is possible to both be blind and do everything normal sighted people can do. Exactly. I 100% agree. I do dishes. And sighted people do dishes. And I'm pretty sure blind people do dishes all the damn time. Pardon my profanity. And I mean, I may not be good at it because I can't see like what, like what spots I missed. Oh, hi there but I can't always see which spots I miss but I feel like if I keep practicing just like with singing I feel like if I keep practicing eventually Messages. I'll get it Josh Price my uncle Joe likes to joke around a lot he likes to tease and he used to always joke about me and you dating isn't that something that we're actually dating now I think it's ironic in a good way I think it's something isn't it crazy though how after we made those jokes, we were actually dating. I guess he was predicting the future. <laughs> I find it ironic in a very good way! Exclamation mark. But send. And him and I are just really, but really good humorous people. Like I said, I hope you guys are comfortable with this. Some people might not be. They might they might be like, oh, oh, don't don't let Siri read your messages on Facebook Live. But other people may be like, Oh, that's awesome that you two are dating. That's awesome that, you know, you've known each other for a long time and you finally got together. Profile Lorraine Hernes joined. Hi. Lorraine. Proof. Heather King Brendan is blind and does lots of things. Yeah. Like I said, it's common for blind people to do what, um, you know, the dishes. Cleaning the bathroom for me is kind of, <laughs> how do I say it? Sometimes I suck at cleaning the bathroom. Other times, I'm, other times, I mean, I'm able to do it. Proof. Heather King, ah. Ah. <laughs> Proof. Invite. Profile picture image. It is some extremely big news. And like I said, I'm I mean, some of my Facebook friends may not want me to want Siri to read the text messages on Facebook Live. And others may think it it's awesome. Sorry if I keep repeating myself a lot. That is something I actually, I also do it off of Facebook Live. I repeat myself a lot. I repeat what other people do when I think it's funny. Oh, I thought I had to sneeze. But I feel like all these guys led me to the right person. And I, I would be more than happy to be friends with them forever. I would be more than happy to be friends with all my exes and, you know, keep in touch with them. No matter what happens. And I would still, I would even help them out through their problems. Heather King washing dishes is pretty easy being blind if you just scrub the whole surface and pay attention to detail. 8.25 mm -hmm. p.m. One notification. Agreed. 
I guess a joke can predict the future. I think it's something. Power for all the jokes that me. We are actually the hate. When he comes home in September, and I tell him, I don't think he will be the least bit surprised. He might say to me, Josh, didn't I tell you that she wanted to be you? And I will make him and he might. I guess you were right all wrong. And he'll probably just laugh at me. Did you get my last message? How I dedicated a song to you? Question mark. Profile. Shan notification. Profile. Shannon Hamilton joined. Hi, Shannon. Profile. Invite. Profile picture. Image. But, like I said, guys, feel free to feel free to share this with every single one of your friends. And if you want to, if you want to spill the beans and let them know, if you want to let them know that this happened, feel free to do it. I really, I honestly don't care. I honestly, I really don't care. Prof. Heather King washing dishes is pro. Shan. Prof. Invite. Button. And if you want to invite your friends to watch the video, please feel free to do it. Messages. Josh Price. You dedicated a song to me. What is the name of that song? Because I didn't get your last message. I don't know what happened, but I didn't get it. But please tell me the name of that song. I would be more than happy. You and me. With blind, with technology for the blind, you have to double tap everything you want to select. Like, I mean, you, you don't double tap the things you don't want to select. Like, if you want to select messages, you double tap that. If you want to select a letter, you have to double tap that. Like, I mean, you're going to end up, you know, touching or tapping the screen and it will say other letters but you don't double tap those because that's not what the letters you want to spell send record audio if that Button. makes sense comment in pro heather king hey you know if you get married to josh in the future you and him can go to camp and share a room together yeah <laughs> wait can you can you really do that? I never knew that. Pro Shannon Hamilton joined. Pro Heather King. Pro invite. Profile picture. Heather King. Hey. Profile picture. Image. I never even knew that. Screen them. I think that's awesome. I am so. I'm. I'm really. I'm super happy. I, like I said, I don't know if I've ever been this happy at all in my life. I mean, aside from camp and, I mean, along with camp and the Lifehouse concert and all the other happy stuff in my life, I don't think I've ever been this happy in my life. It's extremely big news. Profile pic. Heather King, hey. Pro Heather King, yes, if you're married. That's cool. Profile. Invite. Button. 8.30 p.m. 
Sunday. Messages. Now, Josh Price. Wow, that really touched me. Thank you very much. You know, I don't care about you. I know I keep saying that, but I really do. That is the perfect song. I know you do. What will you do if they play that at the concert? You idiot! Oh, I know what to do. Sometimes voiceover doesn't know how to Button. be quiet. Actually, I I know a lot about technology or technology for the blind. If you have something with a touch screen and it, and voiceover is talking to you, you two finger tap it once, two finger to two finger double tap it twice, plays or pauses whatever you're listening to or watching like if you two finger double tap it while you're watching a video it either pauses or Screen. resumes where you left off um if you three finger double tap it turns the speech off and on and if you single finger double tap that means you selected, you know, the app you want or the letter you want or whatever. Comment. In profile, Heather King, they told me and Brendan we could if we got March. Hmm. That's awesome. I I know you mean married. Got March. Profile. Heather King, yes, if you're married. Heather Pro Invite. But Prof Heather King, they told me and Brendan we could if we got March. I agree. <laughs> we will always find a way. Record audio. Button. Prof. Dino Archon joined. Hi. So, um, I really just expressed some extremely big news so extremely big news that I'm, I'm finally going out with this guy that I knew for nine years and we had so much in common and and it finally worked hold on oh <laughs> the song. Heather King, he's so sweet to you I know don't scream don't make me cry I've already tried not to cry at least three times on this live video. And like I've said a million times, it's not because I'm sad. I'm happy. I'm, I'm really... I mean, I'm sad that I broke up with my last boyfriend, but I'm, I'm happy that, you know, I finally got to go out with this guy. For nine years, nine solid years, that... <laughs> We were friends. I mean, I never really talked to him in the staff dining room. That's where we waited for morning advisory um, back in the old days. And I never really talked to him because I guess I was just so shy. Is over now, and we can breathe again. And 
That's my mind. Cap at E. Pro Heather King, you guys should go to the state fair. Yeah, together. Together we should. Pro Deb Stevenson joined. Hi, Grandma. I, I'm trying to ask my mom if we can maybe... Well, I'm going to ask my mom if we can visit you this summer and maybe swim in your pool. It is... It's like 90 degrees out there. Profile picture. Heather King, so sweet. I know. I know. Profile. Annette Lunsford Bontorf joined. Hi, Annette. Profile. Heather King, yeah, I meant together. Yeah, I... But you want to know my advice for going to the fair? Don't eat. It's funny because, um, I mean, I only ate breakfast because we were going to go to the fair six hours later. And this was on my birthday. So I ate breakfast. And we go to the fair at least six or seven hours later. And I keep riding this ride that, like, spins you around and swings you around. And, I mean, I rode other rides. But I rode that one ride at least five or six times. And then at the end of our fair at the end of our time at the fair, I was, like, on that ride again. And I was, like, <laughs> my face felt like I was about to, my face looked like I was about to throw up. And I was, like, gagging. And my mom got me my flip-flops. And she was, like, all right, let's go. And I'm, like, no, 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 no. I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> and she was putting my flip-flops on my feet because, I mean, well, she was giving me my flip-flops. She didn't exactly put them on my feet. She slipped them halfway on my feet if that made any sense at all and i you know just like just shaking my feet putting them the rest of the way on i was just like okay fine let's go <laughs> let's go finish the rest of my birthday heather king does he like rides heck yeah he does one we went to um the fair at step A.K.A. Student Training and Employment Program, if that's what, I can't remember if that's what it's called, but, um, he was, we went to the state, no, we went to the Marion County Fair, and we were standing at the gate of one of these, the rides, it's called the Sizzler, it's the one, one that, it's like the Baby Scrambler, it like spins you around and whatnot, and he was being stupidly funny, and I screamed, um, well, we have little nicknames we call each other because he's born in 94, so I call him a 94 baby, and he calls me a 97 baby because I was born in 97, and he said something stupidly funny, and I screamed, I hear you, you 94 baby! <laughs> and then I was being stupidly silly, too. We call each other some stupid ass funny names. It, it's funny. Really, it is. But it's worth it. Profile. Pe pe profile. Oh. Heather King, then you guys so fit. We do. We do. We, we love rides. We like to be funny. And he said he wants to come to my 21st birthday, and he's, he's definitely coming. Invite. Profile picture. Image. I would think of a really nice melody for us. Like a really romantic melody. But I... I mean, I'll think of one. I know I will. I just gotta... I gotta put some words into it. I'm thinking, like, maybe calling the song, you know, when I first met you, or what I what I thought of you, or, you know, how I think of you, or something like that. I, I want to think of some words. 
Well, I have a song. I think I have the chorus right. I think I have the chorus down. I'm trying to think of some words for the verses, but I call. I thought of this like a couple of years ago. It's called "I'll Cherish You," and I, I love. I love the chorus to it. I made it up myself. I made up the melody and I made up all the words. The song is called I'll Cherish You. Who wants to hear me sing it? Show me some love. Who wants to hear me sing it? Heather King and you guys. Heather King, you guys are the cuties. <laughs> Heather King, there's a country song that may fit you guys. What is it? Pro Invite. Profile picture. One notification. Sub Instagram. Now. Heather profile. Heather King, there's a country pro invite. But who, who wants to hear me sing that song? Like I said, I haven't got, got all the verses down yet. Skin on that pinky is driving me nuts. <laughs> but I can't remember. I think it was actually last year that I came up with the song. I was in my dorm room just walking around. I was like pacing the room. I can't remember if I was there if I was in the shower but I was like coming up with words words were like popping in my head and a melody was like popping in my head and I was singing it to myself and trying to find the perfect words and I was just like which words fit better and I mean I had some of the the um stanzas written like written down in my head Comment in Heather King. There's a country song that profile picture image. Oh, I'm trying to. I remember some of it. Hold on. Notification profile invite Heather King. There's a country song pro invite button. I know it's. I know some of the 843 oh. one notification eight messenger now. Hold on. I'm gonna. I'm gonna use my braille note to write this. But I know part of it goes. I'll cherish you, I'll cherish you and love you all day. And I think the next part is I'll cherish you, I'll cherish you, care for you. No. I'll cherish you, care for you, love you in every way. And we I'll cherish you, I'll cherish you, I'll love you all day. I'll cherish you, care for you, love you in every way. Notifications. Three new. I know that we fit perfectly. I'll cherish you, I'll cherish you, and love you all day. Something like that. I think it's, I know with, I know that we fit perfectly. I'll cherish. Okay, I think I got the chorus down. Hold on. Let me finish this. So 
what I think it is. If I remember right. I'll cherish you, I'll cherish you, love you every day. I'll cherish you, care for you, love you in every way. I know that we fit perfectly. I'll cherish you, I'll cherish you, and love you all day. Comment. And in she sing joined. Proof. Heather Keen, we are thinking up the song. Messenger. Brady Wolf. No, 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 no. Don't read that, Siri. Don't. Okay. <clears throat> I am just so happy that it finally happened. Hold on, let me check something real quick. <laughs> and I, I actually find it ironic. <laughs> I know. I, I, I agree. I, I just hate hurting people's feelings. I really do. Profile. In action scene join. Pro invite. Button. But I will definitely make some verses. When the light is, when the sun is bright, I look up to you and I know that we fit together. But no, it's a song that I, I composed myself. It's called I'll Cherish You. I can actually, I can. YouTube, new from Mommy 05. Let's not. I'll actually I'll play it on piano. I'll play the melody on piano. Whoa, kitty. I don't want to mess up that art project that I just worked hard on. Okay, let's bring the bench. I can play the melody.
April, Heather King, you won't ever be lonely, Andy Griggs. Thank you. Pearl fuck. Heather King, actually, no, not that one. Pearl, oh. Heather King, God gave me you, Blake. Pearl, in actually sing, join. Pearl, 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 invite. Button. So that's my, my own, um song that I composed by myself called I'll Cherish You. I know I was a little off key at the end, but that's okay. But um, thank you guys for watching, and I am so glad you guys support me. I'm going to give every single one of you shout-outs right now. Recording. So every single one of you gets a single, a shout-out. Create lit one. Cameron wants to fill David Poe joined. David. Pearl. Lillian McGrath Lillian. joined. Pearl. Arrow Arts joined. Arrow. Cap it. Oh, 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 W. Yeah, that's right. Arrow. Pearl. Rebecca Sulang. Rebecca. Pearl. Danny Alfaro. Danny. Pearl. Rebecca. Leah. Pearl. Leah. Pearl. Rebecca. Aisha Nash. Aisha. Rebecca. Brendan Siphon. Hero Yukita Kuchi joined. Hero. Cap it. I. Oh, oh. Hero. Why? U K I Hero U Space Hero Yuki Prof Rebecca Nathan Clark Nathan Tyler Sledge Tyler Rebecca Planet Swan Planet Rebecca Rebecca Pat Bernard Pat Holly Jane Holly Erwin Thomas Erwin T J Trust T J Heather King Joe Heather Alicia Profile Melissa E now joined Miss Alicia Miss Strauss Melissa Prof Heather King Profile Jesse D. West Jesse. Heather King. Heather King. Sean C Profile Picture. Sean. Sean Chris will join. Heather King. Heather King. Christina Profile. Mom. Heather King. Pro Heather King. Profile. Heather King. Zoe Bohan joined. Zoe. Pro Heather King. Pro Heather King. Pro Julia Bird. Hey. Julia. Pro Heather King. Oh, it's Pro Heather King. Yukiko. Pro Angela Yukiko. Daniel joined. Angela. Pro Patricia. Pro Patricia. Heather King, Aunt you got it. Heather King, Lorraine, profile, Lorraine. Heather King, pro, Heather King, Heather King, Shannon Hamilton joined, Shannon. Pro, Heather King, Heather King, pro, Heather King, Dino, pro, Dino. Heather, pro, Heather, Heather, pro, Heather, pro, Deb Stevenson joined, Grandma, Heather, profile, Annette, profile, Annette. Pink, Heather, pro, Heather, pro, Heather, pro, Heather, pro, Heather, pro, Heather King, pro, in action, profile in, picture. In action, cap a, a k s a i space. An an action. Prof. I hope Heather, I'm saying that right. Heather, Heather King, Heather King, Prof. Invite button. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for giving me love and support, and thank you to every one of my Facebook friends who have given me love and support since the day I started. Um, every single one of you gets a shout out. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for joining my extremely big news. And feel free, like I said, feel free to share this and let your friends know. Come finish.